Good morning, class. It is Wednesday. How do I know that? Because I wrote it on the board. It's worth it. Wednesday. Yeah. <laughs> it's the only way I know it's Wednesday. So let's go ahead and start with our warm up. We'll go for 30 seconds and jumping jacks. <clears throat> Another 10 seconds. All right, let's go ahead and switch to leg swings. Did you see the message on Facebook about sliders? Finding some sliders. Um, no, I didn't. Okay, no, well, I if you're on carpet, switch legs. You want to find either some plastic bags, like shopping bags. Oh, okay. Or you can find paper plates, something that's going to slide on the ground. Let's take okay. it aside. Laura, what, um, what surface do you have? Do you have hardwood or carpet? On a, a mat down here in the basement. A mat, okay. okay. Switch. Oh. Is it concrete? Yeah, but she's got a mat. Well, it's a mat, yeah. Okay. Um, so you could use uh, those uh, moving sliders. I know, yeah. but I sent, I, I sent those home with my kids to Tennessee. They needed them. Yeah, if you have That'd furniture sliders, those work. Um, since I have concrete in my garage, take it back. I put a towel down on top of my mat because the mat is grippy. And so if I have a towel, then those things will slide. So if you have paper plate switch arms um, or plastic bags or furniture sliders or Tupperware lids, um, those will work. Take it back. So we have several exercises that we're going to use sliders for. So today, yes, chest and back. That's good. Oh, all right. Let's go for a full body flow. If you want to skip this and go find your sliders, you can do that. Okay, well, I'll go ahead and go through. Motions here. <clears throat> I'm at my last flow here. Oh, my goodness. And now I'm going into the last stretch. You also need your dumbbell option. And a chair is optional. Switch sides. And I'm on my last one here. How are we doing? Did we find something to use? Excellent. Alive? Yes. Mary? Success? Success. Oh, yeah. I've got my okay. stuff. Oh, good. Okay. So let me go through the board here and then I'll demonstrate some of these. I might just demonstrate as I go. So, our first exercise we're using the sliders, we're doing hamstring curls and then knee tucks. We're going to do 10 of the hamstring curls and immediately switch into 10 of the knee tucks. Then you can rest however long you need to catch your breath and then start over until the time runs out. Next, squat roundhouse kicks. Get ready to be a ninja. <laughs> and then we're going to dumbbell bent over rows. So 10 of those squat roundhouse kicks to 10 of the bent over rows. We're switching back to our sliders. We're doing a one arm push up fly where one arm goes out wide, comes back in. We're gonna do five on each side. And then we're gonna do a glute bridge march with those sliders. Lunge kick and quarter squats I'll demonstrate, bicep curl to overhead press. And then our last exercise with those sliders, we're gonna do glide outs like we would um, our ab rollouts, except for we're using those gliders. And then a crab splits. So lots of different things on the board today. Trying to shake it up, give us something new to work with. 
Um, let us, first we've got our hamstring curls and our knee tucks. So, you're on your mat with your sliders. You're gonna dig your heels into your sliders and lay down. I'll move the chair out of the way here. And then you're going into a glute bridge. You're letting those legs fly out and then you're bringing them back in. Out straight, taking those heels in to slide them back to start. Really working on your hamstrings here. You're gonna have to get some force into the sliders to bring them in. Then after you hit 10 of those, you're flipping over. You're putting your toes on the sliders. Now you're in a plank position and you're bringing those knees into your chest. Sliding those feet in. And you'll just have to do your best with what you have. It's not gonna be perfect, but just fight for what you can do. <clears throat> um, I'm debating on whether to go through the whole thing or just demonstrate as I go. So you might just forget when we get to the point. So I'll just demonstrate as we go. Sound good? All right. Yep. <clears throat> Alrighty, so get into place for those hamstring curls and your sliders. And we're gonna go in five, two, one, and here we go. We're doing 10 of these hamstring curls and then flipping over for 10 of those tucks. Is that glute bridge? Watch, this broke. You might have to dig in really hard for the sides to slide. That's part of the workout. Flip it over when you get to 10. I'm curling up my mat as I go. Oh man. Just keep going back and forth, 10 reps of each, switching back and forth each time. Woo! We're down to 25 seconds. You got it, you got it, last 10 seconds. All right, rest. Our next set of exercises, a squat to a roundhouse kick. So you're going in and then out with your leg, switching legs each time. We're doing 10 here, and then you're grabbing your dumbbells for bent over rows. Your palms are facing your legs, and then you're driving your knee, your elbows back behind you for those rows. So squat roundhouse kicks first. Squat, one leg comes in and out. Just lift as high as you can. Good. This is kind of what I use a chair for to aim my leg to get higher than that chair seat. You're doing 10. Do one more and grab those dumbbells. Bend over slightly, knees are also bent. Your palms are facing your legs. Drive those elbows back behind you, squeezing that back. Good. Two more. All right, let's switch back to those squat roundhouse kicks. Here we go.
Good. Good. Let's do two more here. And grab those dumbbells to finish it out. <clears throat> 10 seconds, really squeeze that back tight. All right, we're back to the sliders. I'm gonna pause my timer for a second because this might be longer to demonstrate. My watch is broken. All right, so push ups. Put on your hands. As you push up, or push down, I should say, one arm comes off the side, and then you're bringing it in. Other arm out to the side, then you bring it in. If you feel like you need to drop to your knees, go ahead and do so. That allows you to get a little bit deeper into that push up. In fact, I'm going to stay on my knees for this one. I feel like I have better control. We're going to do five on each arm, and then you're switching on to your back into a glute branch, and then you're just marching your feet in and out like this. After you hit 10, you'll flip over to those push-ups again. Make sense? Mm -hmm. So get ready. On your knees for those push-ups so you can get deep with that wide stretch. Make sure you're not, your butt is not up in the air. I want you angled out so the weight is on those sliders. All right, here we go in three, two, one, five on each side, switch arms each time. Woo! I feel that one for sure. Once you hit 10 total, flip on your back for those glute marches. marches we're doing 10 on each leg so it's 20 total for counting each time and then you'll flip back to those push-ups 10 total five on each side make sure your core is strong on this one don't let your hips drag to the floor Keep going, keep going, We're almost there. Two, one, alrighty. Our next set of exercises. We're doing a walking lunge for two. So lunge, and you'll kick back behind. Lunge, kick back behind, and then you're gonna do a quarter squat back to start. Lunge, kick back behind, lunge, kick back behind, a squat, pivot, and a squat back to start. Then our second exercise, we're doing a dumbbell curl to an overhead press. Curl, press, so we're doing 10, here. All right, so we first start off with those lunge kicks and then those squats pivoting back to start. We're going to three, two, one, lunge, kick back behind, lunge, kick back behind, squat, pivot, squat, back to start. Lunge, kick, lunge, kick, squat, squat.
Good. We're gonna do five rounds on this one before we switch to our dumbbells. So I've got one more here. Squat, squat. Dumbbell time. Going for 10. Curl and press. Keep those elbows tight to your body. Nice job. Keep going, a few more reps here. Let's do one more. All right, back to those lunge kicks and squats. Lunge kick, lunge kick, pivot, pivot. On that kick back behind, you're really squeezing your glute hard. Keep that leg up. One more here. All right, so the next round, we're gonna start with the dumbbells. Our last set of exercises. We have the gliders again. We are doing a glide out. So they're on our hands, we're on our knees, and we're letting our hands drift out. And then we're bringing our hands back in. This one is really hard for the surface I have. So just do your best. Lean out if you need to do one arm at a time to bring it back in. Do so. But you're really contracting your abs here to bring those hands back in. So it's like those roll-ups that we have at the gym. Our second exercise. The gliders are on your heels or your heels are on the gliders, rather. You're coming into a crab. So, hands are back behind you. You're lifting your glutes. So you're backwards or on, on all fours. And then you're letting your legs come out and in. Out and in. If you need to scale this down, you can be on your back into a regular glute bridge. But try to stand up on your hands, lift those glutes, and then you're letting your legs split apart and coming back in. Again, do your best. We're just experimenting here, different ways to work out with these sliders. So get in place. We're doing the glide outs first. We're aiming for 10. All right, going in five. Oh, I forgot where he went. All right, here we go. Couple more here. One more. And let's switch to those crabs. Heels are in those sliders. Dig in. Your hands are behind your hips. Your fingers are facing your, the front. Lift those glutes out and in with those legs. Splitting them wide. <laughs> Once you hit 10, <laughs> if your mat looks like mine, straighten it out. <laughs> We're flipping back to those slide outs. Let's just do five here. We're almost done. If you have time, flip over and switch. We're done three seconds. All right. 
right. Well, that was an interesting go. <laughs> How did your sliders work out? It was fine for the first one, but I really couldn't do it with the second one. On uh, quick enough. On that. On which one? On the second one, the one where you put your legs out. Oh, on the crab one. Yeah, the crab one. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I mean, just do the best you can. If you want to do one leg at a time. If yeah, that's what I kind of had to do. Yeah. Um, obviously, my sliders are not working perfectly either. <laughs> so just do the best you can. I just wanted to shake it up with something. You can only go so far with what you yeah. have right now. So, all right. So let me give you a preview of the board. We're going to do another round. We're starting out with those hamstring curls and knee tucks with those gliders. And then we're going to the squat roundhouse kicks and the dumbbell rows. We're going to the push up flies and the glute bridge march. And then the lunge and the quarter squats back and ending with those glide outs. So, hamstring curls and knee tucks to start with our sliders. <laughs> Start my timer, and here we go in five. All right, take those heels in. Hamstring curls. Once you hit 10, you're flipping over. Toes on those sliders. Tuck those knees into your chest. Oh my goodness. You get those on your hands or your feet? <laughs> One leg at a time on this one. Two, if you can, but the effort should be both legs at the same time. All right, let's finish it out. Get those knee tucks. Ten seconds. Keep going. All right. Woo! That is a fight. Just make it work. All right, we're going to our squat roundhouse kicks and then our bent over rows with our dumbbells. <clears throat> Ten seconds. Here we go. Squat down as you come up. You're lifting that leg into that circle. Good. And let's switch to our dumbbells. <clears throat> Hinge at those hips, slight bend over, palms are facing legs. Drive that elbow back behind you, really giving your back a good squeeze. Good. Do two more. One, two. Switch back to the squat roundhouse. Good. 
Good. A few more of these. Two more. One, two, and finish it out with those dumbbells. <clears throat> Active squeeze in that back. Keep going, five more seconds. All right. We're doing the one arm push up where that one arm slides out, back in, other arm slides out, back in on those gliders. And then we're going to the glute bridge march for our second exercise. We've got 10 seconds. Here we go. Five on each side, 10 total. And then you're flipping over to your back. Oh. Ten on each leg on those marches. Try to get that leg straight when it goes out. And then flip it back to those push-ups. Ten total on those push-ups. Fifteen seconds, I'm finishing it out with those marches. Glutes are high, hips are raised. All right, nice work. We're doing the lunge, kick, and then that pivot, squat back. That back leg, as it comes up, squeezing that glute to kick it back behind you. The second one is the bicep curls. Oh, we're gonna start with bicep curls, actually. Bicep curls to overhead press. Start with those once we hit 10, then we'll switch to those lunges. All right, here we go. Elbows stay close to your body. Good. Don't let that torso rock with the momentum. Keep it still. Do two more. All right, drop those dumbbells. Let's go to those lunges. Lunge, squeeze that glute. Lunge, squeeze that glute. Squat, squat, back to start. Good. Let's do one more of these and then we'll switch to our dumbbells. All right, grab those dumbbells. Elbows to the sides. Up and up. Good. Keep it going. We have 10 seconds. We're gonna finish it with these dumbbells. Keep pushing, almost there. 
All right. Our last set. We've got those glide outs. However, you could manage it. I tend to have to pull one in at a time to make it work. And then those crab splits. If you also need to do one leg at a time, you could do that. Five seconds. All right. Let's start with five on these slide outs. Once you get five, then switch to those crab splits. <laughs> Keep those hips high on those crabs. Still looking for 10 on these ones. And then you'll flip back over for those glide outs. I love the best you can manage them. Looking for five on the glide outs. Here we go, crab splits. We're gonna finish them here. Keep going, we've got another 10 seconds. In the wind. <laughs> All right, we're done. That was an interesting go. <laughs> Thanks for humoring me. I don't know if those will really work, but I'll try to figure out. Yeah. But it worked. It worked. It's just a little bit of a struggle at some points, but nice job. Way to stick with it.